Hey guys, welcome back to this video. This is where we stopped the last one, which I showed you how you can verify your Facebook profile and also read the terms and conditions of Facebook ad policies so that you know when Facebook is going against you or when you are going against Facebook ad policies. So this video now, I'm going to be introducing you to Facebook business manager and also the interface, how to navigate around it. People can use their smartphone to do all these things, but me, I recommend you to using your laptop or find someone that has one to learn and practice this skill so that you learn how it was you can even use your mobile phone to do this training and everything so you can download the facebook ad manager on play store or app store on your smartphone and start using it one thing about the mobile device or uh, mobile app or facebook ad manager is that there are some things that you cannot do with those mobile apps so basically we, what we do on facebook ad manager on our smartphone is we use this to check for metrics we use this to check for analytics of our facebook performance so in this video now i'm going to be introducing you to facebook ads business managers and what it's all about so the first thing you need to do now is let me close up these places all right let me close out these places um close here the first thing i will do now is i'm going to search for facebook business manager all right just search for business manager like this or search for facebook business overview right it's good to open up the first thing is here it's going to open up like this. Now, this is where you need to start creating your first, first Facebook business manager. And one thing you need to know about this business manager is that you can create two business manager, and these two business manager can contain or carry up to 100 Facebook ads accounts. So, the business manager and Facebook ad account is not the same. The business manager is where you set up everything about your business like pixels i'm going to be telling you all these things in these videos so make sure you are following up and also implementing everything i'm going to be teaching you in this video so in this business manager now this is where you need to create our own first facebook business manager what you need to do for me is like i said always is read the facebook ads policies so that you know when you are going against the system or when facebook is going against you so the first thing you need to do now is after you have verified your Facebook profile, like my own is already verified. Let me show you here. Um, go to the Facebook. I see at least a week ago, all right, a week ago, my own is already verified. I decided to create this business and also this profile to use for my business and everything. So you can see my ID you provided as proof of your identity has now been confirmed. So that means I can go ahead and start creating my everything I'm going to be doing. So your own doing that then way wait for some days or in a week before you start creating your first business manager. So you come here, you can see everything is here. They are still showing a lot of things here. They have terms, they have help centers, they have cookies, they have policies. Please, please, please read and uh, understand the Facebook ad manager policies so that you will know when you are going against the systems or when it's still going against you. That's my first advice for anybody. So I don't want to go into telling you events about this until I'm going to show you how to, first of all, is to click on create and this dialog box will open up the first thing you need to know is you choose a Facebook business name. Okay, you choose your first business name. I'm going to choose my first business name, which is my direct. So this is my first business name now. I'm going to leave my name as this. Then my email address, this is my email address is going to be in the same format. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to create, maybe use another different emails or use my main email address. I'm going to be covering this particular person to put the email that I use. Most times, when you submit this form, the thing will not go. Most times, if you submit this form, it will not go. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just submit my, put my email address I want to use, then try and submit it. Please make sure you submit a real email address so that you don't have issues with Facebook. Then click on submit. Then let's wait for it to load. It's going to ask us to verify the email address, of course. So what I'm going to do now is allow the system to really reload and create our own first business account. So while we're waiting for this thing to load, one thing you need to know now, you can see that it asks us now to verify our Facebook email address. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to confirm this email address and verify it. I'm going to click on done. Okay, when I click on done, it's going to take me back to my Facebook business manager, right? I'm going to verify it. So the email have landed on my my mailbox here on my smartphone. So I'm just going to click on 
my my bro so the first thing here is most times if you create this thing automatically they are going to restrict your account for security reasons you go to my profile here you can see the notification here now okay you can see my profile now they have restricted it because i created a new facebook ad account so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to open the account quality to also show that actually i'm the one that owns this face business manager all right that's why i said there are two layers in protection of your account and there's other things that you need to have in mind once you create the business manager automatically they are going to automatically restrict your assets can see now restricted so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to click on confirm identity the same time again to confirm identity this one take i think it takes two even one day it takes like one day or two days to verify it so i'm going to just click on confirm identity you don't want to have this experience okay this is what happens to most facebook ad accounts then i'm going to click on confirm my identity to verify that actually i'm the one that owns this business so they have they said that i have 29 days remaining to finish your request for preview now when you click on request for preview or review account then this is what you need to do click on i'm not a robot right then you click on that's why i'm saying you should put the correct name here because they're going to ask you to for your id card and everything so here they say upload your id so i'm going to upload my international passport as well or you can use your name and you can use the international passport in this aspect so look at my international passport here click on confirm so let's allow you to load you can see my international passport here so i'm going to block some my details everything here then click on ok continue and I'll allow them to do their verification process is finished. So I'll click on close. Another new way to do this thing is to contact Facebook ad team. Look at how to do it. You can use either on the Facebook ad manager or chat to them directly. And this is how to chat Facebook support system to quickly verify these things. Now I can show you the thing here. They don't have anything for me so what i'm going to do now is they said no account issues on asset issues anyways they have issues with my account but it's still it's what i'm showing you now you see what this is happening here now they are even telling me that i don't have any issues in my account but anyways let's <laughs> get started so what i'm going to do now is uh you can see this is my main account this is my business main accounts the first thing i'll do here while i submitted that review all right they are going to be reviewing my account and also I can continue to do what I'm, do, I'm supposed to be doing but before you fund the wallet before you fund your account and everything you need to allow them to verify your account in your own case your own might not be like this they will not you know bounce back your verification stuff it can just be automated once you just create it you are good to go this is what happened to most new accounts on Facebook so I just opened my I selected the business manager I'm using. That's the business I created right now. I'm selected it to check the app quality, our account quality. So there are different ways you can troubleshoot these things. One is to verify that you're actually the person that owns that business. Now there have been two layers in this thing. One is your main Facebook account, and two is the business manager. You can see now they are telling me that I don't have any restrictions. I don't know why they are even giving me restrictions in any way, anyways. But anyways, let's get started. You can see no ad account, no pages. That means my account is totally zero. All right? My account is totally zero. There's nothing in this business manager. And we are going to be starting to do everything from the very beginning to the last. So you can see now they said advertising restriction. There's none. Uh, please go and read the ad policies. Again, I've said this in more than 10 times. So what I'm going to do now is to start editing or start verifying my business manager click on business settings when you click on business settings this way you add quite a number of things on your business account maybe updates with your details of your business the address your phone numbers your website and everything about it so the first thing you need to do now is you can see now i have full control this is my first business account my first or uh, my facebook ad account here you can click here to edit or edit business account permission if you click on edit business account permission you can see here this is where you need to set up details all right they say full uh, view advanced options anyways if you like this one um for me I, for finance i'll click on manage all right i'm the person that manage everything the manager here is to know so 
I have to control of everything here. So if you click on the second one here, which is edit information, uh, put the email, the same thing, you can just leave everything it's already set up. So what I'm doing here is I'll come to the business information. The business information. This is where I need to put up my legal name. Right? My business legal name is Big Thing Digital Creation. Right? Then the country, my business is located is Nigeria. Then this is my the name, the legal address of my business. Alright, then this is it. This is it. And I'm okay with it. So right now I don't have business domain. Let me just put a domain. I'll still buy this domain anyways. Uh, I can still remove the domain names. Okay, let me just say tech me business.com.ng. Okay, I think I bought this domain name some time ago. Let me check whether I got the correct spelling correctly. All right, let me just check it. Okay, I got the correct name of the domain. So I'm using I'm going to be using this domain name also for these tutorials of everything I'm going to be running on both the ad policies, both everything about these tutorials. I'm going to be using this particular domain for everything I'm doing here. So actually, this domain name is valid. You can see it now it's valid. So there's no content in this page. So let's just go ahead and start and click on save then i have saved my business details now they said something like about business verification status most times it takes facebook some time to actually verify your business i don't know it's what well, it's becoming too very very serious and it's becoming becoming very very um hard for facebook itself to verify your business manager you can delete your business manager permanently if you want to to create another one Maybe you made a mistake, you want to create another one, can delete it. But if your business manager is restricted, you can't delete it. But now at the early stage, you can delete it and create a new one. They said the ad account creation limit. Once you didn't verify, once you didn't violate Facebook ad policy, you can create as many ads Facebook ad accounts. Alright, so for now, I think we have done with Facebook um, ad manager. The first thing here is I have not verified my email so i need to log into my email and verify it so to do that is i need to log into this email address so i have just logged into my email address now and i'm going to verify this ad business account with this email now so i'm going to be stopping this video here because i don't want to make it to be longer now when we come back um i'm going to show you how i was able to verify this thing i think the email is not coming right away the way i wanted it on your own is going to come directly i don't know why my own is delaying so i'm going to be coming up in the next video i'm going to be showing you around everything in this video how to set it up on these menus and i'm going to be explaining everything from a to z so that you understand everything about your facebook ad manager so that you can start your advertising processes and campaigns so that's going to be all in this video if you like this video and you want to get more from the next video what you need to just do for me is to like this video subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on the notification bell so that you can receive the next video and subscribe videos i'm going to be bringing up to this channel so thank you and i'll see you in the next video